Here is 1945 D. Jefferson Nickel in MS-68 condition with full steps. This delectable superb gem exhibits virtually flawless surfaces. The strike is razor sharp throughout, and there is not even a single detracting abrasion. Also beautifully toned, both sides are layered in soft pastel iridescence of sandy gold, pale pink, ice blue and mint green. Simply gorgeous. The surfaces are simply incredible in their preservation and are graced by delicate pastel hues. It was sold for $2,880. Number 6. This is 1941 D. Jefferson Nickel in Mint State 68 with 5 full steps. The 1941 D, like many Jefferson Nickels, is plentiful overall but becomes a major condition rarity in the uppermost full steps grades. This lofty example displays pristine, glistening mint luster cast in delicate iridescent toning. The strike is sharp, and neither side has a single notable abrasion. It was sold for $3,000. Number 5. This is 1966 Kennedy Half Dollar from Special Mint Set. Graded in MS-68 condition with deep cameo condition. A truly remarkable example of both the type and issue, both sides are fully untoned with bold field-to-device contrast. Virtually pristine, as well, and sure to catch the eye of discerning Kennedy Half Dollar collectors. Although the Mint improved the quality of the 1966 SMS Half Dollar issue after receiving complaints about its 1965 SMS predecessor, Precious few survivors from a mintage of 2,261,583 pieces exhibit enough contrast to support a deep cameo designation from PCGS. This gem was sold for $7,200. Number 4. This is 1950s Lincoln sent in MS-68 red condition. Pristine surfaces yield pumpkin orange luster and rich, satiny texture. The coin is entirely devoid of spots, with sharp design elements and incredible eye appeal. An essential acquisition for the registry collector. It was sold for $10,800. Number 3. Here is 1934 D. Washington Quarter with heavy motto and small D. Mint Mark. Graded in Mint State 67 by PCGS. This enchanting superb gem really needs to be seen to be fully appreciated. Both sides are dressed in a bold array of multicolored iridescent toning that includes shades of pale apricot, pinkish rose, golden olive, champagne pink and pearl gray. The FS501 attribution of this issue refers to what Bill Fivas and J.T. Stanton, Cherry Picker's Guide, 2012, believe is just a single leftover die from the 1932D issue, attributable by a small D mint mark that is also known as the type of 1932. The authors describe it as, a rare variety by any standard. It was sold for $11,400. Number 2. This is 1961 D. Washington Quarter in MS-67 plus condition. Undoubtedly from an original mint set, this originally and attractively toned Washington Quarter displays the most vivid shades of emerald, orange and gold, particularly on the obverse. The surfaces are delightfully smooth and the luster is nothing short of intense. Although available in an absolute sense, late-date 90% silver Washington Quarter issues such as the 1961D are surprisingly rare in the finest mint state grades, as here. It was sold for $24,000. Number 1. This is exceedingly rare 1958 Lincoln scent with double dye obverse. Graded in mint state 64 read by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, an intriguing variety and exceedingly rare coin that stands tall among the highlights in the present collection. Indeed, this is one of the most significant Lincoln scents of any variety. A particularly strong double die in the 20th century US coinage series, all types included, the spread to the doubling is wide and pronounced on the letters in the word liberty and the motto in God we trust. Less pronounced doubling is also evident on the digits and the date, particularly the 8. The spread on the lettering rivals that of the famous 1955 and 1972 double die obverse scents, although the extreme rarity of the 1958 double die obverse means that this variety is less well known than those other, far more plentiful varieties. Satiny and finish with full light rose luster, a touch of haziness to the obverse seems to be the only feature precluding a full gem rating. It was sold for $336,000. That's all folks. Hit that subscribe button to stay tuned for more captivating content about rare coins, fascinating stories, and timeless treasures. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and share it with fellow coin enthusiasts.